Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are fine. I hope you guys are okay. So today we are going to make another video about Blue Team tools and operations. Uh, so today is the last video about PFSense and then we are going to another tool, right? So today we are going to see the system logs option, okay? Uh, so PFSense has a very, very nice log uh it catches everything and then it separates into the file and we can read that on the platform okay uh to do that we are going to status and then system logs and we can see here we have few options viral dhcp authentication ifsec ppp ppoe l2tp server open vpn ntp package and settings and then under the option system, we have general, gateways, routing, DNS resolver, wireless, and GUI service and OS boot. So each one of these is one kind of log, a different log file, all right? So first we are going to check on general, okay? Uh, well, we are going to the bottom, 15, 15, today yep so here we have few options i was playing with uh the website where i i was checking some websites and then we have some service here and interrupt storm that was a problem then i restarted the service okay so let's check here and then we have the final rules i accessed before and here's the time Okay, this is not the time on the Ubuntu machine, but the PFSense time. Here, right here the time. Okay. So it saves everything. Now, uh, let's go to... What? what? Uh, let's go back to the top. And then we have here the options like gateway okay here we have all the information if we go to the bottom page the same thing here same interval and then the logs okay ports everything uh what else the, sorry not the port the pid routing we have also okay dns resolver wireless oh here we don't have anything well, we are not connected to wireless, so. Uh, and then we have the OS boot, all the information about the boot, okay? So for me, the most important logs are from the firewall, what it, it catch. So we have here on March 15, block private networks from one block, okay? Uh, we blocked some protocol here, and we allowed a UTP protocol uh on the ip to destination google of course obviously here was from uh if i'm not mistaken it's from whatsapp okay yeah probably it's from whatsapp so it's all allowed here and then if you go down we have few more okay that were blocked here today and the time okay so here the firewall is the most important thing that we can check what happened in the past what's happening right now okay we can view in uh in in the this time uh in the now time let's say okay uh i forgot the word just forgot the word sorry so in firewall we have a normal view we have dynamic view and this is nice because we can pause here and then when it gets 500, it's going to pause. We can read all the log entries, okay, here. Uh, and we have summary view. So summary view, we can see the actions at 39% passed, went through, and 61% were blocked. Okay, what interfaces? So we have the LAN here on the LAN interface. Uh, we had the most action let's say and then we had the one interface and then dmz it's like nothing right uh the protocol 
was used UDP 59% and then TCP 41 we have like a 00, .00, 0, .00 something EGMP and ICMP IGMP and ICMP so the source IPs I ha we have here 49% from 012 I think this is my thing terminal I have config uh no it's from my windows machine 49 percent it's from my windows machine that is right here and 44 percent is from this ubuntu machine and then we have the local host here okay and then we have this one that's my main computer and then we have this website here sorry this device right here that I have to check probably is from uh, the DMZ. Yeah, probably is from the DMZ. Uh, the destination IPs we can see here. Google, obviously, forty-six percent. Others is thirty-eight percent. And then we have this IP right here. I don't know which IP is this one, but we could check. Uh, Google again, and then we have two more IPs right here so in the source port what ports were used here others and then we have six percent udp 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 okay and here destination ports udp 53 tcp 443 https tcp 80 http uh udp 137 other and udp 67 okay and here we have all the firewall information with summary. It's very nice, I think. And we have GHCP service here running. And then we could check. Okay, we can filter also. Uh, we have the authentication options here. Let's see about the authentication here. 15, now monitoring attacks, exit no sign, no signal, and then now monitoring attacks here. The rule successful login okay and web configurator okay so back to the top and here we have captive portal we don't have anything here because i deactivated it ppoe logins we don't have anything but let's just back here to authentication and then we have os user events okay we logged as root and OS account changes. We don't have any change actually. Let's go look here. Admin. Uh, and then here we have IPsec. Nothing. PVP. Nothing on this. Nothing. Okay. So guys, uh, the most important, as I told you guys, the most important thing for me is this, okay, because we have to check every single thing we have to analyze the firewall time to time right uh let me see here uh i will check this look up from let's see if it's connecting dns look up and well this is the last video about pf sense so this was just a overview on the system log okay uh, it's taking a little bit longer. I don't like it. So yeah, then ask Google. Okay, so Here's the query and then just got there and then we have the trace route and the ping there So that's it guys for now Thanks a lot for watching my videos if you are subscribed and you like the video just give me a like and If you are not subscribed and like the video give me a like and subscribe to my channel and help my channel grow a little bit more uh, thanks a lot again and two guys on other videos.